everyone welcome back to my channel it's Dakota just here for a weigh-in Wednesday update and to share what I did this week um, so let's get right into it so this week went fairly well as far as the diet goes I stayed on track and I was able to I did a small little circuit workout and let me tell you I was highly disappointed in myself no I shouldn't say that I was highly shocked <laughs> at how little I could actually do compared to what I thought I could accomplish. Uh, for example, I was like, I could do like 20 crunches. Like it's not going to be that bad. It'll be horrible after, but I'll take a break after 20. I did like 10, I think. And I had to have a break like right after. It was kind of ridiculous. Um, but I did a small little circuit workout. I'm going to call it a workout because it was probably about, it was only 15 minutes. Of doing like I tried some what I don't know what they're called like lazy push-ups where you're on your knees but you're still using your arms I tried those um, and then I did some crunches and I tried planking which was hilarious um, and some lunges it was what I could accomplish with a little three-month-old who wants to be hold held almost 24 7 um, it's been a really big challenge for me to find times to work out and honestly times to even like meal prep and do things that I really want to do. It's been really difficult and challenging just because I do have a three month old who is battling a really bad like acid reflux battle right now. Um, we are trying to get her some help though and we got her on some medication so I'm hoping that we can turn things around but it's just been really difficult because I feel like she's always in my arms all the time and I'm either walking around with her or sitting her upright to just try to keep that acid down. Um, anyways, that's another story. <laughs> anyways, so I was able to do that. My biggest accomplishment though, I think this week, which I think is also, I'm going to double it as my non-scale victory, is I was able to go on a hike which is like the first real workout I've had in over a year. Um, I was able to do, we went on this really pretty hiking trail and it's like a mountain that you go all the way up to almost the top of it and then you come down. It's a pretty narrow trail though, but it was so pretty and despite being completely out of breath and it was so hot because I think it was like 105 outside, it was like shaded most of it at least um but it was so pretty and i'll share some clips here with you guys hey guys i made it we did a hike i'm really red but it's really hot and we did it in 30 minutes. And we did it in 30 minutes. And I don't know how long it is, but I'll put it on the screen. And there's my mom. Just totally getting in my screen. But she did this after a quadruple bypass. That's pretty awesome. 2,136 steps. One mile. Okay, so it's a mile. But it's up and down a mountain. I'll show you the mountain in some videos. But at the very end of this hike is a church in the middle of a desert <laughs> like the middle of a mountain desert there's a little church and it's open and i've never been inside oh it's kind of creepy i'm not gonna lie and it smells like an old historic room <sighs> like what kind of church would be in here i'm gonna be honest with like two little windows okay but um, we're gonna have to go back to the car now. So there's probably another like quarter mile to the car. So we're gonna keep going. Okay. Well, as you can see, there was like caterpillars everywhere. Um, it was so green. We've had a really great monsoon this year. I think this time last year, our deserts looked dead like a desert should but this year it is so green and I think we're actually going to be getting ready to do some family pictures with that in our background because it is just so gorgeous here lately with all of our monsoons um, but the caterpillars there was like thousands of caterpillars so, um, 
anyways um i was able to do that hike though which was about one mile and i mean it's not just a mile though i mean you're going about half of that mile is on incline and then the other half is going down and they're on slippery rocks some of them are really steep so i definitely feel it today in my feet <laughs> Um, because I did not wear the right kind of shoes. I need some different shoes, but I also feel it in my legs and uh, my thighs. So it felt really good though, honestly, just to be working out my lungs because I don't feel like I really have done anything cardiovascular in so long. So it was nice to just feel that I was able to accomplish that. Other goal, let's talk about that. My other goal is to drink more water. I could still do better in it. I did improve compared to the week before, but I need to get on it. Um, I need to dig out. I bought this one jug a long time ago that was, I think, like a full gallon, and it's like marked with times, and I need to get that buried out of my closet and wash it up and use it because I just don't think I'm really great at measuring out and paying attention to how much I'm drinking. Maybe that'll help me, especially because I'm so busy, and I think mom's or anyone who lives a busy lifestyle really would probably relate is it's really hard to be paying attention to yourself and what you're consuming and what you're drinking and what you're doing for your health when you're trying to pay attention to your little people that are with you <laughs> so um i'm definitely going to pull that out this week and try to challenge myself to drink that every day that's going to be one of my goals and i'm hoping it'll help me flush out some more um weight I'm a little, when I did my weigh-in, I was a little bit disappointed because honestly I did expect to lose more this week, but I haven't gained and that's like the biggest thing. I just need to keep looking at it as you haven't gained, you're at least maintaining or losing a little bit and moving forward. So um, without further ado though, let's get to that weight loss check here. <laughs> As you can see I'm now 267.8 which means that I believe I had a two pound weight loss because I think I was 268 or no 269.8 last week so it's two pounds which is really great though it means I'm still moving forward I wish that it was a greater loss but you know what it's a loss and that's what I'm gonna take it for and I'm hoping that this coming week I'll be able to work out more and maybe it'll help me out to lose some more weight or um, Honestly, it just feels really good to even be active at all. So I think I'm just going to enjoy that. Uh, so this coming week, I am going to have the same, one of the same goals is to increase my water intake. The other one is I really want to pay attention to how much I'm snacking because I feel like this week I just, I felt really hungry um, often actually. And I did stay within my low carb you know food options but I felt like I ended up eating a lot of like Atkins bars which I know too many of those can actually conf like conflict with your weight loss so I want to try to make some healthier options I did go grocery shopping two days ago and I got some more like food so I can make little snack containers for myself and my husband hopefully that will help me out this week so it's easy to grab and just go with it when I'm hungry rather than grabbing an Atkins bar even though some of those are really good I'm not gonna lie so that's and I also I want to you know what I'm gonna give myself one extra challenge this week so I also want to try and get out and start either fast walking and possibly a little bit of jogging maybe I had a dream that I was able to just walk out of my front door and like go for a run and honestly I've been having so much extra energy lately that I really want to try doing that since I just had a baby three months ago I'll probably pee myself the whole time but we'll try <laughs> so we're gonna go ahead and give that a try this week though it'll also happen to help with my activity I just need to go find some new shoes to wear because I thought my shoes were running shoes but they're really after going on like that hike and even just like the walking part of it I'm like these are not made to walk in these were made to like take your kid to the park in or something 
and so I definitely need some new shoes if I'm going to be walking around the neighborhood or anything like that. I hope you guys had a really good week. Hopefully this next week is also great for you. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for more weight loss and other videos and then also to just follow my journey. Don't forget to hit that bell button though so that it actually lets you know when I upload a video. And please don't forget to like this video. Leave me a comment. I'm feeling really lonely lately without any comments. So please let's socialize and support one another in this journey. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye-bye.